Pinch hitter here with the bases empty and one gone in the inning. A couple of righties starting to loosen now in the Up bullpen. Next for the Pirates, the shortstop, Tim. Tim Money. Money comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. He'll enter play here with an average just over 250. 10 home runs and 28 RBIs. Hey, get the pitch. Drive it right here. This pitch is popped up, calling for it. Quinn. And that's the second out of the inning. Juan Nicasio is on to pitch now from the bullpen the now to start inning number seven. Number 12. Juan Nicasio. Yeah, that's what you want to do when you're playing on the road. Take it right to the home squad and get a win. Now the pressure is off. If they get one of the next two, the series is theirs. And tonight's ends as a 3-0 shutout win. The Phils pick up win number 20 on the year. Aaron Nola with his fourth win this season. Alex Cobb pitched well, allowing only two earned, but ends up taking the loss. Brandon Mauer. Now from the north shore of the Allegheny River, there's a beautiful look at PNC Park in Pittsburgh. Tonight, game two of this three-game series between the Philadelphia Phillies and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Steven Matz is the man on the mound for the Pirates in this contest. What do you have for us on MH? Matt, uh, he's coming off a great outing in my mind. I mean, he pitched into the ninth inning. He got the win for his team. He's a guy that's durable and is able to go deep in games. Nobody Hopefully, we'll see that again from him today. Settling in now, Odubel Herrera. And there's a look at his home and road splits so far this year. Breaking ball is swung on and bounced to short. And the throw to first is in time, one gun. With that, here's the starting lineup for the visiting Philadelphia Phillies. HR, how do they lock up a series victory here on the road? Well, Matt, this lineup is interesting to me because they're not a club that's going to hit for a lot of average. Not many guys in the lineup. You look at the lineup, the numbers are not there. They're the bottom third in the league as a team. In the so striding forward Batting now, forth. Tim Money. Shot. First chance Tim for him here after Money. appearing as a pinch hitter in the game last night. Into the windup and the pitch. Swing and a line drive, but foul. These Phillies, Harold, as they enter play here tonight, have got to be considered one of, if not the hottest team in baseball right now. Winners of eight of their last ten ball games. Yeah, Matt, they're feeling it right now. You know, they're starting to play good ball. They're really playing good. And they're closing in on a division, and this time of the summer, it's all about baseball. You come to the park, the grass is green, you smell the hot dogs, and you're excited to play even in the afternoon during batting practice. And that's what I see with this club right now. Come on, guy, get your pitch up there. Ready with another 0 2. Another foul ball, and this battle will continue. Let it fly right here. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Way outside. One and two. After multiple pitches were fouled off, it gets a little disappointing on, as a pitcher. Pitch so right you think, say, I'm going to throw one way off the plate and see if he'll chase it. Didn't happen. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. Hey, pitch up there, kid. Let's go now. Here he comes again. One, two. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. That is the sixth foul ball in this at bat. Now, to those who like to see a lot of pitches, he's doing it for you. A swing and a miss. He offered it a ball way outside the strike zone for out number two. Now a moment here at PNC to take a look at the Pirates lineup card in this one. Striding in once again, Tim Money. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. All right, find Ready with the let's first go, pitch. Go. Here it comes. Shoots this one yeah, to first. Yeah. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. And they'll hold that runner at third as everybody moves up a base, and they're loaded with one away. Yeah. 
stepping in and ready for another shot. Julian Quintana. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Let's go now. One time. He's going. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Pitches a cold strike. The throw. Not nearly in time as he took that one on the pitcher. Oh, baby. See you drive it. Hey, get your pitch up there. Come on now. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Curveball bounces, and this one gets away. So the lead runner holds on, but the trailer will take second. Runners are at second and third with one down. And a swing and a miss, and another punch out here. Six already, and that's out number two. Well, his struggles continue. It's been a rough go of it at the plate with him, and watching this at bat, it's clear to me that his rhythm and timing, they're just all off. The Even as a pitcher like three. I was, you could tell these things Andy and exploit them. Now some action in the Phillies' Larry, bullpen as a right-hander begins to crank it up out there. Hey, see it. Drive it. Let's go, big dog. Hoping to limit the damage, here's the pitch. Now a breaking ball runs in on him as he's got to get his hands out of the way on that pitch. His pitch count is getting up there in the inning now. He needs to get this frame over with sooner than later, so forcing contact oh, and getting the defense involved right is probably the best thing he can do. Come on, big guy. What time? Here you go. If you pace, get he's pitch, set, huh? and the 2-1 pitch. And he just misses with a curveball. I don't know, Matt. Look here. He fell behind 3-1 now. I'm looking at the on-deck circle. That's just a better matchup. There's no need to give in let this guy hurt you when you can go after that other guy who you got a chance to get out. Second and third, hey, two away. And he misses with it for ball four. So the bases will be loaded now with two away. Well, some might say a walk there is okay because you've got first base open, but he's been struggling out there. And if you're going to work around hitters, you don't want to work around hitters in the bottom of the lineup. Here you go. Digging in for his second at bat, Jim Cagle, eighth batter of the inning now with the bases loaded and two away. There you go, left fly. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Hey, let her rip one time. From the belt, the pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Heading after it is Goodell. And no one can get there. He'll try it again. Hey, one pitch right here. Come on now. Hey, your pitch right here. Let's go. Again, a 1-2. Hit on the ground to short. Reined in. And the runner scores from third as they extend their lead. Make it 5-1. to one. Well, he's really struggling. And right there, you get an infield hit. Nothing more frustrating. That just kind of epitomizes what's been going on with him today. Not a lot of balls hit hard, but they're getting hit. Digging in to try it again. Christian Colon. He's 0-1 thus Christian far. Christian Colon. He's set. Here's the 2-2. Hit back up the middle. Scooped up on the backhand. Throws in time, and that's out number one. Ready now, Abdul Mays. Up next for Philadelphia, catcher Abdul Mays. Hey, no problem. Make a pitch. Get us out of here. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Hit to short. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Phillies get a couple of hits here, and it leads to one on the scoreboard. On now to the bottom half of inning number four. It's the Pirates five. And Digging in and looking for more. Next Tim Pittsburgh. Money, Good one for two shot. on his line so Tim far in the game. Money. First pitch of the at bat. And that misses for ball one. Hey, your pitch, your pitch right here. The 1 0 delivery. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Morov has it. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. 
So no runs on a hit here, no errors, one man left on. On to the top of inning number five we go. Pirates on top, five to two. Ready for another shot now, now. Tim Money. We'll see if he can come Tim through in a clutch spot Money. here. Two on, two out here in inning number six. Here we go, one time right now, let's go. First pitch on its way. And that's lifted the other way out to left. Hawk has a beat on it. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Pirates strand a couple. Hey, looking back. Ready no once one. again, Tyler Kyle Goodell Bang. comes into this right, at fielder. bat 0 for 1 Tyler in the ballgame. 5 2 our score as we play inning number 7. Hawk toward short. Oh, look at the dive. The throw to first. No, really? Safe. Great effort comes up just short. And now runners will be at first and second with nobody out. So coming to the plate, Michael Pock. How about Left well, fielder, yeah, just Michael right Pock. One out. You got one. Chopped weakly to the left. And indeed, yeah. he'll take only the out at first as the run comes in to score. Hey, they get the run there, but this late in the game with the lead in hand, you'll definitely trade an out for a run. That doesn't mean a whole lot. Digging in once again, Tim Pittsburgh. Money. The shortstop, Tim Money. Get your pitch and drive it, kid. Here you go. Swing and a little blooper to center. Herrera moving in. He makes the play. Really had to hustle to get to that one. Two gone now. And no tag at second. Hey, one of the keys to having a good record in baseball is to win some games at home. So this was a big baseball here on MLB and Network. Now, Today, the third and final game in this three-game series between the Philadelphia Pirates. Phillies and the Pittsburgh Pirates. Major League Baseball on MLB Network is next. At the plate, Tim batting Money. Back. The season Let's batting go, go. average comes in Tim down in the 240s. Money. And he takes ball one. Harold, these Phillies as they begin play here today. Despite the loss last time out, they enter this one in good shape. Winners in seven of their last ten. Yeah, Matt, they're feeling it right now. You know, they're starting to play good ball. They're really playing good. And they're closing in on that division. And this time of the summer, it's all about baseball. You come to the park, the grass is green, you smell the hot dogs, and you're excited to play even in the afternoon during batting practice. And that's what I see with this club right now. Okay, let's go, big fella. Into the windup, here's the 2 and one pitch. Oh, and he'll try to take control of the inside part of the plate with the fastball as he backs him off a bit. Well, this veteran pitcher lets you know right away what his game plan is. Fastball inside. He's trying to take away that inside part of the plate to open up the outside. Showing us early. Line drive to left. He leaps, but he can't get it. It's down for extra bases. And he'll pull into second with one away. Yeah, Batty, you can't fold the left fielder there. You'll see he makes a tremendous effort, but he just can't haul it in, and it gets past him for an extra base hit. Like the effort, though. Josh Bell the next to hit. He has Batting no six. prior history First against this play. pitcher. Josh Bell. He's, going. He's, He's set. Going. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw. And it skips in as he steals the bag easily. You know, I was pretty surprised to see him on the move to third because it didn't seem like he had that much of a lead. But he made it work out. That was really impressive. Here's the one and two. Now about a 58-foot breaking pitch that he wisely lays off here.
high in the air out towards shallow right. Santana has it and I'd be surprised if they send the runner and he'll think better of trying to score as he holds it third with two away now. Digging in the switch hitter Amuri Lorenz and he's just hoping for something to go his way in this one and as you can see it's not been the case of late. Two outs here with a runner at third. Tried to stay back on the change up there but this is chopped foul at home plate. Well he's out in front of that change up. I tell you what he had the honor of the fastball the fastball the pitch before and back with the change up. That's a great combination. Line softly toward the hole throw in time and the side is retired. Pirates leave one. They trail it here two to nothing. Ready for another chance. Brian Holiday. He singled his last time up. Brian Holiday. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one. Hit hard on the ground to second. And that gets through for a one-out base hit. And he is in there. Oh, the old CNI base hit. The changeup's down. The batter goes down to get it and still finds a hole to put it through. Good pitch. Better hitting. Trying to pick things up where he no left batter. off. Right. Tim Shortstop. Money. Tim Money. Let's go right here. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Santana has a read on it, and that ends the inning. One, two, three, go the Pirates. They're still down. Digging in. Tim Money. On one for Pirates. two with a double on the right. ledger Shortstop. so far. Tim here Money. comes the first pitch. A fastball down near the shoe tops. Well, it's been a good outing so far, but he hasn't really racked up the strikeout totals that you might think, Dan. Yeah, it amazes me how every game you pitch can be so different, Matt. Sometimes it feels like guys can't touch you and you're just punching everyone out, but other times you don't have your good stuff and you really rely on movement and location to get outs. That's been the case for him today, and it's really working. And that is through into right field for a single. Well that curveball's on the outside half you usually shoot it the other way but he stayed with it and because he got the barrel in the right place he still got a base hit. Some action out in the bullpen couple of right handers starting to loosen up. And this one's in the dirt. And forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. Top a rip like you can. Here we go now, huh? Runners on his way to third. Pitch taken for ball four. The throw. And you can tell by his body language that he's beyond frustrated by that call. He's got to be wondering what he's got to do, but the last thing he needs to do is to let it get under his skin. That will only make things worse. Pitch outside the throw. And they've got the runner trapped in a hot box between second and third now. And they'll just tag him here for the out. Standing in, Tim Money. Two for three with a double on his line so far. Money. Into the windup and the pitch. And a fastball just a bit high. Bases are empty here, nobody out. Drive it like you can. Let's go. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Nope. And that one stayed too low, apparently. Hey, what time? Right now. And the pitch on 2 and 1. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind 3 and 1. Josh Bell is on deck. Line toward the gap in left center. That's in for a base hit. He's now three for four. Well, he came to play this game. That base hit right there hit really hard. That makes him three for four on the day. What a day for him. Now a left-hander up and throwing in that Philly bullpen. First baseman number 55. Sean. Runners on the move for second. Pitch outside the throw. That was about as easy as they come right there. Hard to say whether that'll be defensive indifference or a stolen base, but either way, he's into scoring position. Throw him out. 
And the runner's breaking for third. Oh, he leaves the fastball up there. Mistake in location. He is going to pay for it dearly as that ball is sent over the wall. A home run. A two-run blast to straightaway right field. 12 home runs for him now thus far. And with that, it's now a 6-3 to three ball game. They seem to forget that the game started a while ago, but better late than never, I guess. Sometimes... You might think it's just another win, but it's awfully hard to win in this game, especially on the road. But they find